this is definitely a staple in my wardrobe it's screaming spring i absolutely love it i'm actually obsessed with it hey guys back with another video and as you guys can see by the title i'll be sharing all of the new bits that i bought from zara and i have to say i was pleasantly surprised with the things that i saw i can't remember the last time that i actually walked into the store i feel like i did all of my zara sales online now that it's getting a little more brighter i thought it was time for me to go in store and pick up a few things that caught my eye first i had to start off with this chunky knitted vest as soon as i saw this i fell in love so firstly i actually saw this online and I went into store to try and pick it up but they were sold out in the two stores that I went to so I luckily picked it up online and ordered it for next day and I just had to get it I had to get it on time to show you in this video so of course the first thing that caught my eye was the color I love a pop of color and especially when it comes to spring and summer I love adding color to my wardrobe and I have to say I think red looks nice on my skin as well but what I love about this is that this is very versatile so I can wear it in the spring just as I'm wearing it now without any top or shirt underneath but also in the cold months i can wear it with a jumper or a long sleeve top underneath or a shirt i really like the three statement gold buttons it kind of gives a nice little statement look to this piece and makes it look really unique i like the pockets as well the knit is so nice because it's like a big chunky knit wear and i love it and i love it i did want it in a medium but i actually feel like the small looks okay because it's kind of loose fitting and it's slightly cropped as well so you can wear it with your high-waisted trousers or even a skirt this is definitely a staple in my wardrobe all year round after seeing the red i then saw this one i said okay i think you're coming home with me too because are oh, you seeing this cardigan it's got the same bold gold plated buttons on the front which i love um but it's long sleeve and i love that it's navy not black i don't think i would like it as much if it did come in black i've paired it with some shorts and some tights and some flat shoes but again this is very versatile i'm really loving this knitted style the chunky knit and although spring is next month this is something that will definitely stay in my wardrobe it's really classy it's really stylish and edgy i think the chunky knit style kind of gives you an edgy kind of look i love it the only thing is i think this is too small i think a medium size would have been a little bit better because i feel like the arms because i feel like the arms are a little bit short but i really really like it and i like that they've got the shorter version the short sleeve version and the long sleeve version as well next is this denim jumpsuit and guys this was 9.99 in the sales the fit of this is so stunning i was going to go for small but i thought let me go for a medium just in case i have um added on some nude court heels what i love about it is that it also brings in the waist complements your body rather than it kind of just being baggy and straight and oversized it is very nice i love the straight leg i love straight leg um jumpsuits because they look so good with court heels with sandal heels and even with trainers um you can dress this up or dress it down i love it this is probably my favorite wash of denim like the medium mid blue denim and it's lovely i can't i can't actually find anything negative to say and like i said i picked it up for 9.99 and this outfit is everything and more when i looked at it on the hanger i already said yes this is for me and even recently i've been trying to find things for my new body i'm all nice and slim again and i've got to my body goals and I feel like now I'm re -find I'm finding my style again because I, I am at my weight that I was post baby so we're a whole new me and when I saw this I said we gotta have it I absolutely love it I've paired it with these beautiful heels that I got from Pretty Little Thing I think these heels just add a little bit of edge I love that it has no sleeves I love the waistcoat cropped style that meets at the waist with the high waisted trousers the buckle at the ankle even the material the fabric the brown the color i am obsessed this is the perfect co-ord for a smart stylish occasion absolutely love it okay this has to be my favorite piece i mean zara i love this this is stunning 
Look at the peplum detail. It snitches in the waist and gives you hips and the shoulder pads add to the structure. This is stunning. If they had this in different colours, I feel like I would get it in every colour because this kind of style would never go out of fashion. Because of the small detailing, the shoulder pads, the cinching in the waist, the peplum detail, this just elevates any basic simple look. Absolutely love this. I've paired it with some straight jeans and there were some heels that I wanted to style them with, some court heels that were black and they have gold peak toes. I think that would look absolutely beautiful with it. But this... This is chef's kiss. This is chef's kiss. I think it was $69.99 or $59.99. It is a little bit pricey, but when you put it on, you understand the price. And you know there are some pieces that you put on and you kind of think, mm, I don't know if it was worth the price, but I love it. I love the one button to the side. I love the asymmetric look. I love everything about this. I've got it in a size small. Um, the arms are okay. I do usually like my arms a little bit longer, but this could work. So, obviously my stomach isn't, you know, as perfect as it should be, but this dress is cute. I love it more than I hate it. I definitely love it more than I hate it because the fabric is amazing. Like, it's really, really thick fabric, really, really good quality. The dress cinches in again. It's like it's gathered at the waist, so it kind of pulls in the waist, which is really nice. It's really fitted and snug. Um... It's a little bit short for me. I don't like dresses this short. I would feel a little bit uncomfortable wearing this out, sitting down and standing up. Um, yeah, it's a little bit too short for me. I think if it was a tiny bit longer, I would have kept it. But it's a really nice style dress. I've just paired it with my short kitten heels. Um, it is very cute. I like the button detail on the front. Do you know what? It is very flattering and this will make anybody's body look but it's a little bit too short. It's just a little bit too short for me. And that's just personal preference. This is one of those I'm trying, but I'm not trying kind of looks, if you get what I mean. It's really cute. This is nice. Next is this cardigan. And I really, really liked it. Liked. Because why? And everyone I've seen wear it, it still has the gap. Like, obviously I know that the way that they've clipped it together is you know the little silver pin um fastening but i i really wanted to keep this but just the fact that you can see what's underneath like i was just thinking of a solution shall i get like a colored because i've got a brown um bodysuit maybe i could just wear a brown bodysuit so it looks like my body underneath but i think because it's open it doesn't look as classy as i would like it to look if it was like fastened like together I would have loved it more I do like it the fit is very Zara has been doing some really nice structured well fitted pieces recently I really like how it goes in at the waist and um, the loose sleeves on the side and it goes um, loosely at the bottom with the sleeves at the side to accentuate the hips really really like it. it is really unfortunate that they've got this gap in the middle like why is it there why didn't they just put it together so as much as i do like it i really do i don't like the open because i just don't like to show my underwear and you can see my bra you can see the color of my bra underneath and i just think me wearing something underneath is just going to ruin the whole look i don't know i don't know do you guys get what i'm saying yeah this is going to have to unfortunately be a no for me Next is this top, which is really cute. I could not bother to iron it. I think these kind of tops are just timeless. These are the kind of tops you should always have in your wardrobe for those special occasions or for those times when you don't know what to wear, when it's, someone's just invited you out and you need to throw something on that's really nice, really stylish, um, sophisticated but sexy at the same time. Um, I got this in a size small. Um, and of course I wouldn't wear it with this bra but um, it is very nice it, and you could either have it over the trousers um, but I have decided to slightly kind of tuck it in a little bit just because the style of jeans that I'm showing you guys in and here's the pink here is the pink should I try it on for you guys I should shouldn't I yeah let me try it on for you guys I feel like this was only about 23 £22. 
the only negative thing is I did have to tie the top with a hairband because I couldn't do the buttons they're really really small and the elastic to attach it is very small so I would need James to help but if I'm struggling I think he would definitely struggle to put it on too um but other than that this is a very nice top oh I really like the pink this is really nice this is really really nice ladies and it's so affordable such a nice dressy top i would also wear this with satin skirt i would wear it with a nice black pencil skirt you can wear it with jeans even blue jeans like this top is so versatile you can style it in so many ways it's lovely i absolutely love it i'm actually obsessed with it like there's something about nice high neck tops and neck high neck dresses that just blow my mind it just gives a nice look of elegancy kind of lifts your neck makes your neck look nice and long and slim and slender yeah love this my husband would love this top so the next piece that i was going to show you was actually this black dress but it is yeah it's going back to zara it is basically a midi um bodycon slightly high neck dress um but it's a lot shorter than i wanted you're probably thinking Desi, why are you buying short things and then saying that you don't want to wear short things basically i am on the hunt if you guys can help i'm on the hunt for um the length between mini and midi no the length between mini and a, just above your knees black plain dress because you know when sometimes you've got those blazers there's like a blazer that i bought and i want to wear it with a mini dress um not a mini dress i want to wear it with a shorter dress rather than a midi dress because it just doesn't give the same vibe but i thought i might as well show you the jacket that i bought you guys already know i'm obsessed with zara's jackets i love them i have so many of them in different colors but when i saw this one i was like yep I need to add this one to my collection because I don't have a colour like this. It is beautiful. As soon as I saw it, I fell in love. Um, they also had it in black, but because I have a black similar one, I said, let me go for this colour. The reason why I like this one, um, which is quite similar, my other ones, let me show you. All the other ones that I have are basically the same style like this. But as you can see, the buttons are smaller. The lapels are slightly smaller. Um, it's still double breasted which i love but there's something about this one that just caught my eye also like the stitch in here which is really really nice and with the jackets from zara i always buy them if i like them because they are long-term pieces they are pieces that will stay in my wardrobe for many years i will wear this every year yeah love this olive green color on me it's absolutely beautiful so this is the final piece from my zara haul and do you know what to get the right size was really difficult First of all, I love this top. It's absolutely beautiful. It's screaming spring. Even though I don't wear pink all the time, I do love beautiful pink pieces and this is really feminine. I really like the halter neck. I like that it is fitted around the waist, but with the sizing, like I was just about to say, I tried on a small, which was very, very tight. There was no medium, so I picked up the large. Now, the strap is a little bit loose, so I might have to get that like, I think I, if I could just, I think I could just get that taken in just a little bit and it would fit perfectly. I am quite bloated um, and, but the large, yeah, fits. And um, I think if I was to get a medium, it would be a little bit too tight and uncomfortable. So the large fits comfortably. But this is what I find so annoying about Zara sizes. Like this is a large, but the other tops that fit fine were size small. But you know, we all know that's Zara for you. I really like this top. Like I said, it's perfect for spring. And I've paired it with these jeans. I love these jeans, by the way. They're from ASOS. Um, these jeans and my court heels. Really, really cute. Really feminine. And I'm just loving the baby pink vibe. I think I'm definitely going to wear more baby pink um, this spring. It's very nice. And even though I don't like to show cleavage, I think it's covered well like it's not too much it's not showing uncomfortability it's not showing too much um so this is i think definitely a keeper thank you guys so much for watching let me know in the comments which is your favorite piece and i'll see you guys in my next video bye